Hi, the PoE power over internet is limited to 100 meter, it's about 300 feet. If we need longer than 100 meter, we can add this PoE extender to the links, so it will repeat the PoE network. Here we have very typical system setup. This is the PoE MVR. And we got the first piece of the cable connected to the MVR. And now we connect to the PoE extender. It repeats the PoE before it reaches to the camera. What we need to know about the PoE extension, how to use it, in this video we are going to talk about it. First thing you can see is there's no power source, right? We don't need additional power for this PoE extender. But it also needs the power. How, how the PoE extender get the power? You can guess it will just come from the PoE switch. So, so the first thing is the PoE extender needs the power source. Your edge device must a PoE compatible device. It doesn't work with the, like the passive the PoE. What is the reason? The passive PoE use the DC 24 voltage. In the standard PoE, it only recognize 48 voltage. So if you're using the light like, passive PoE, use the DC 24 voltage, the PoE standard will think the voltage is too low, it will enter the protection mode. This, this is the first thing. The second thing is it must be a PoE compatible edge device. If you just connect the PoE, the end of the cable to the such something like the router, which doesn't support PoE, it will not working. Why? The reason is there's power hand shaking between the PoE switch and your edge device. Before the PoE release the power to the edge device, it will classify and also verify your edge device. If you cannot get the positive feedback, it's not going to send the power. If it not send, it's not going to send the power, then this PoE standard will have no power to keep it running. What is the solution if you, are, you need to work with the non-PoE non device, such like the router? You can add this PoE speeder. The speeder will complete the power negotiation, just the power handshake with your edge device. I understand you just need the data, no problem, because the PoE speeder will separate the power and data, and you just need to connect the data to a router, you are going to have the data. The second thing about the PoE is the waterproof. If you are going to use this PoE extender outdoor, it's very important to assemble this grant properly. And this tool, the wrench, is must use tool. The hands usually is not have enough force to close the wrench. So you must use this wrench to close the both, both sides tightly. Don't worry, it's not going to crash your cable. That's the only way to keep the water out of the PoE extender. The next thing is the surge protection. If there's lighting happening in the area, the lighting could strike the tree or the other object and spread on the earth. This is the copper cable. The copper could observe the surge and the search will travel to the both end. If your device, like the MVR or the camera, is not strong enough, it could damage the RJ45 port, even the whole device. One of the solutions is you can add the search protector before the camera or the recorder. There's ground spot. The PoE search protector will observe part of the search, also introduce the rest to the ground in order to protect your IP camera and the network video recorder. The next thing is how to pick the cable. Actually, CAFIE or CASE, it doesn't matter. What matters is what make of the cable. You should pick the cable which is made of the pure copper, 100% copper. If you're using the CCA, the system could be shortened very fast because there are always power loss during the transmission. The longer the distance, the more power loss will be. If you choose the low quality cable such like a CCA type, the voltage drop will become very serious. So when the power reaches to the end of the camera, the voltage could be lower than 20, 24 voltage. So that's the reason it's not going to 
in initial your PoE system. All right, that's all for today's video. If you have any question about the PoE, please leave a comment section below. See you next time.